Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. The scene you saw just now is one of the system to prevent an intruder. So today we are going to build the system using Raspberry Pi Pico. Let's do this together. Connect the ground to ground. Signal to GPIO 28 and VCC to VBUS. Take a jumper wire and connect the Pico's ground to the negative terminal of the breadboard. Take an LED. The longer leg needs to be connected to Pico's GPIO 15 via the resistor. So, take a 330 ohm resistor and insert it into the breadboard in the same row as Pico's GPIO 15 and the other leg into the same row as the longer leg of the LED. Then, insert a male-to-male -male jumper wire into the same row as the shorter leg of the LED and connect it to the negative side of the breadboard's power rail. Insert the buzzer into the breadboard. Connect the positive leg to the GPIO 14 and the negative leg to the negative terminal of the breadboard. Okay, now we can plug a micro USB cable into the micro USB port on the Pico. Then connect the other end of the micro USB cable to one of the USB ports on our Raspberry Pi 400. Now to program this project, we need to use Tony Python IDE. Make sure to choose MicroPython Raspberry Pi Pico. As usual, import machine so we can control our Pico's GPIO pins and we need to import the uTime library so that we can handle everything to do with time. Next, we will set up the three pins that we are going to use. GPIO 28 for the PIR sensor, GPIO 15 for the LED, and GPIO 14 for the buzzer. Now we will define a callback function to handle the interrupt. These lines are to make sure that when interrupt is triggered, the shell will print the message and at the same time, the LED and the buzzer will be on and off for 100 milliseconds 50 times. This line is to set up the interrupt. Lastly, these lines are to make the LED flash slowly even when there is no motion being detected. Click the run button and save the program to our Pico as googleralarm.py. Wave our hand over the PIR sensor to see the result. That's all for today. I'm Suat from Cytron Technologies. Thank you for watching.